What's up guys? So today my journey takes me to Philadelphia and I'm here with Mobile Instinct and we've come across this school, this middle school I believe and uh, to totally by surprise. Yeah, we were, had other plans but they fell, fell through so today this is, this is our mission today is trying to get into this uh, building which well, looks straight out of an apocalypse. High weeds, smashed windows, Tons of graffiti. It's probably going to be wrecked from the inside, but we'll find out once we get inside. Someone's notebook still here. That one looks pretty fresh. It almost looks wet. I was gonna say, there is a definite sure faint smell from at some point, I don't know, last night, the night before. Wow, look at that hallway. Yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a really narrow one. Scrapper's really got the heck out of this place. I got only one stall. Check this out. Do not open window, beehive just outside. So I think this actually started off as a middle school. I think that's what the um, sign outside of the school said. It was some kind of middle school. But then it changed over to a communications technology school, high school. But uh, it seems like the last papers that we're finding are from 2012 to 2013. Newspapers are all dating to 2012.
So we just found the uh, auditorium, which was really cool. A lot of cool pieces of uh, graffiti on there. Now we're looking for the, uh, trying to find the gym, which is probably in the basement. This used to be an old middle school. My middle school, the gym was in the basement, so. <laughs> so, uh, it's a good chance that it's probably gonna be in this basement too. Can't even get in here. It's like a prison. Never mind. So most of these classrooms, they're all empty. There's not even desks left behind. So I'm not gonna go through every classroom, show you each and every one when they're all the same, just different artwork, spray painted. Except for this one, I actually had that jail cell looking door. But uh, we're still on the hunt for the uh, gym. So we just came into this classroom and uh, actually I'm not sure if this is a classroom, there's no blackboard or anything here, but uh, we happen to stumble across which looks to be some kind of dry blood and a lot of it. If that's real, somebody had a bad day. What is going on? Creamy cleanser. Oh god, you're looking at that? <laughs> <laughs> Have we reached the top yet? I have no idea what that says, but it's pretty cool looking. So this classroom is a little different. This one actually had um, taught photography in this classroom here. Um, it's really cool, something I've never actually seen before because my school didn't even have that option to take a photography class. But this is a revolving door, real skinny. If I can step back here. It's 
So you would go in there and it would spin around. And it would take you into here, which is the dark room. It's all painted black. All the little individual stations. And you come out right over there. That's really cool. I wish my school actually offered that, but never did. Probably never will. Just another empty classroom. Kind of looks like the uh, Road Runner. Oh, it has like projection All right, guys, so that's going to do it for this video. Uh, don't forget to check out Chris from Mobile Instinct. I'll have his channel linked up at the below and uh, at the end of this video. And uh, we're going to get on out of here and get something to eat. And what else do you eat when you're in uh, Philly but besides cheesesteaks? So we're going to head up uh, Gino's and Pat's. Absolutely. I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.